using this script we can convert analog pulses into markers and then different labels can be assigned depending on the amplitude of the pulse on the analog channel. A similar capability already exists in the software but it only applies to digital channels. If we go to analysis, stim response and digital input to stim events, we'll be able to convert digital channels or any channels in fact that contain 5 volt pulses into markers. The script does something different. As you can see we have pulses that range all the way from 0 up to about 5, uh, no, no more than 6 volts and we can assign labels, markers with labels depending on the amplitude of each pulse. Let's go ahead and run the script. Initially stimulation event markers are placed at every peak location and then the script analyzes each of these poses for their maximum uh, maximum voltage and assigns a label. So let's have a look. Here is a pose that falls in the range between 3 and 4 volts, here is a pose that falls in the range between 0 and 1 volts and so forth. Now that we have these markers we can automatically obtain the instantaneous heart rate for every one of these types of labels. We just have to go to stim response analysis and let's perform a measurement at each stimulus event and it will be only for 200 milliseconds. We output the result into Excel and we'll just use the mean measurement on the heart rate channel. And here we have the result. We can see a summary for all the categories. We have uh, stimulus in the range of 1 and 2 volts, 0 and 1, 2 and 3, and so forth. 